is getting more expensive to rent homes in Michigan. According to rent.com, it went up nearly 14% last year, making it tough for some to find an affordable place to live. Good evening, I'm Ann Emmerich. And I'm David Andrews. News 10's Deanna Giles here in studio tonight to tell us more about the current state of the Michigan rental market and what officials say is causing the rates to rise. Deanna. Hi, David and Ann. It's no doubt Michiganders are feeling the pinch when it comes to the cost of renting. As of 2022, nearly half or 45.9% of Michiganders are feeling the burden of rental fees. According to the state of Michigan housing data, the median rent for that year was just over $1,000. Ten years earlier, the rent was listed at $755. Now local organizations are pushing for a more structural balance between landlords and tenants. Kelsey Brianne says she paid nearly $800 in rent. I had pests in my house, so I had mice, I had squirrels in the wall, I had possums in the basement. I mean, I wasn't paying a reasonable price because I wasn't in an environment that was safe to live in. After her lease ended, the landlord wanted to raise rent and eventually she moved out when she couldn't afford it. Brianne and others are feeling the pinch when it comes to renting in Michigan. According to Rent.com, Michigan has the third largest rent increase in the country from last year at 12.47 percent. That's unacceptable. The state has a very easy fix to this, which is that they can lift the ban on rent control and let Lansing and all of our other cities around the state have a conversation locally about how to pass policies that would uh, prevent these outrageous hikes. Will Lawrence is pushing for change that will empower tenants over landlords. The Michigan Housing Authority says because Michigan is short 190,000 homes, the cost of rentals have gone up. If I had to guess, I think the cost of our rentals uh, and our, our single family homes are going to go up until we get ahead of the game on the supply um, factor. So we need to work quickly to build additional units in our state. We are missing talent and people who want to come because of that. And I think, you know, Michigan has increased people's rights dramatically in the last couple of years. But in order for people to fully embrace that and feel safe, we need a safe place to lay our heads at night. Lansing Representative Emily Dieven-Dorth and others introduced a package of bills centered around empowering tenants during that rental process. In the studio, Deanna Giles, News 10. All right, Deanna, thank you. In her State of the State address, Governor Gretchen Whitmer said she wants to spend nearly $1.4 billion to build affordable homes across the state. 